All right, welcome. My name is Daniel Bader, and I'm going to give you a quick how-to and how to deal with forward references in uh, Python 3's type hints. So the problem that we're running into today, or that we're going to talk about today, is um, how would you type hint a piece of Python code that looks like this? So we have a single class um, that we're defining here. It's called my class, and it has a single method on it that uh, is supposed to return uh, an instance of the actual class, right? It's just going to return the self object. And uh, this is just uh, sort of a, a toy example. You could imagine that this would really be um, sort of a more full-fledged uh, factory method. So maybe that would be a class method. But uh, in the end, what you wanted to do is you wanted to return an instance of my class while you actually haven't fully defined my class yet. So if you think about a way to um, add type hints to this class or to this get instance method. Sort of the first thing that would come to mind is that you would just add a regular uh, type hint for the return value. You would just tell it, hey, this returns an instance of my class. This actually works fine if you run it through a type checker like MyPy. Just going to pass um, all the checks. Uh, you're not going to get any warnings or errors. However, if you try to run this in the Python interpreter, what's going to happen is it's going to blow up and you're going to get a name error that says my class is not defined. And um, it really isn't, right? The class is still being uh, constructed or is still being parsed out by the interpreter and it doesn't know yet what my class actually refers to. So how are we going to deal with this, right? What's happening here? The one keyword that you need to know about uh, to help yourself out here is forward references is exactly what's happening here. We're, we're referring to a type that hasn't been fully defined yet at the point in time uh, where we refer to it. And uh, when you look at the actual pep that uh, adds um, type hints to Python 3 or kind of documents how they're supposed to work, there's actually a whole section on forward references with uh, more code examples and kind of doing a deep dive on this stuff. So you might want to check this out. The gist of it, however, is that to fix this name error issue, all you need to do really is instead of uh, passing in a type reference for the return value, we're just gonna give, or we're just gonna surround that type reference um, with quotes to turn it into a string literal. And by convention, a type checker like MyPy is gonna know that um, we're not actually referring to some random string, but um, it's just a workaround to uh, to identify these forward references. This is gonna know what to do with it. Um, so the great news is that this actually passes validation in MyPy, the type checker, and it is actually also valid Python code now, which is really something that uh, we obviously care a lot about. All right, I hope this helped you out. Take care and have fun writing more Python. Bye now.